everyone. Today we'll learn how to add decimal numbers. Let's begin. Addition of decimal numbers. Our first step will be convert the given decimal numbers into like decimals. If you do not know how to convert, you can watch my other video on like and unlike decimals. I will share a link in the description. You can watch from there. So first step, the given decimals, whatever the decimal numbers we have, we'll convert them into like decimals. Second step, we'll line up the decimal points. We'll count the number of decimal numbers and then we'll make a line of the decimal points only. And then after writing the decimal numbers, add each place value. And if there is any carry, we'll do the carry as well. Step four, place the decimal point in the sum directly below the decimal point. Let's understand these steps better with the example. So our question is, there are three decimal numbers, 5.83, 680.9 and 74.649. We have to add these. For that, our first step is convert them into like decimals. So for like, uh, so for, first check these are like or unlike decimals. You can see there are two decimal places, one decimal place, three decimal places. This is unlike. So to convert them like, we have to check the maximum number of decimal places. There are two, one, three. So we'll make all the decimal places three. For that, in the first decimal number, we have to add one zero. So the decimal places will be three. Here we'll add the two zeros. So our like decimals will be 5.830, 680.900, and 74.649. Now you can see all these decimal numbers have the equal decimal places. That is 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, and 1, 2, 3. All the digits after decimal are 3. That is, they are equal. So after this, our second step is line up the decimal points. So how many decimal points I have to line up? Because I have the three decimal numbers I have to add. So one decimal point, two decimal point, three decimal point. I'll write the decimal in a line. So now I'll start writing the digits. So before decimal, I'll write five and after decimal, eight, three, zero. Here before decimal under five, zero will come, then eight and six. And after decimal, I'll write nine, zero. 0. So here before decimal 4 and 7 and after decimal 6, 4, 9 and the plus sign. So I have arranged the decimal numbers in the addition. So let's start with the addition. Before adding, I'll write the decimal point in the answer as well because it will come directly below these decimals. Okay, let's add now 0 plus 0 plus 9. I'll get 9. Then 4 plus 3, I'll get 7. 9 plus 6 is 15. 15 plus 8 will give me 23. So 2, 3, 23. 2 will be carry and 3 here. 5 plus 4, 9 plus 2, 11. So 1 here at the top and 1 here. So this is 11. 11 1 is carry and 1 down there in the answer. Okay, so now 7 plus 1, 8. 8 plus 8 is 16. So 1, 6, 16. 1 will come carry and 6 down. Now 6 plus 1, 7. So I have my answer now that is 761.7379. So this is my answer. So I have added the three decimal numbers. Let's do one more example. Now, this time I have four decimal numbers. One, two, three, four. Now, you'll say this is a whole number. Yeah, we'll convert into like decimals. So, here, three decimal places, two decimal places, no decimal place. So, here, two decimal places. So, we'll make all the three decimal places to make it like decimals. For that, I have to add two, one zero here, three zeros here, and one zero here. So, you can see I have added. 1, 0 and 4, 5 and 8. After 8, I'll write decimal and 3 zeros and 8, 9, 0. Okay, so let's start the second step. Line up the decimal points. So how many decimal points I line up in this case? Because I have four decimal numbers, I'll 
write four decimal points in a line. One, two, three, four. After that, I'll start writing the first decimal number before decimal nine, after decimal two, five, four. Here, before decimal three, after decimal four, five, zero. In the second part, before decimal eight, after decimal zero, zero, and zero. Next, next decimal number is before decimal seven, one, and then eight, nine, zero. So I have this decimal, I have arranged these decimal numbers in the question. Now let's add four and all zeros. Uh, before adding, I, I'll write the decimal in the answer as well so that my decimal points in a line. Now let's start adding. Four plus all zeros will be four only. Then five plus five is 10. 10 plus nine will give me 19. One, nine, 19. One carry and nine down in the answer. Now four plus two, six. Six plus one, seven. Seven plus eight will give me 15. So one carry and five in the answer. So let's add these. Now seven, nine plus one, 10. 7 plus 3, again 10. 10 plus 10, 20. 20 plus 8 will be 28. So 2 will be carry and 8 will be in the answer. Now 2 plus 1, 3. So my answer is 38 point. This decimal. Okay, now I have the answer. Now after that, you need to remember only one thing that you have to line up all the decimal points. And arrange it and you'll add like you have done addition in the other numbers. So it's very easy. It's your time to do some workout. So you have to write the answer of 1.2 plus 3.4. So add these decimal number. Write the answer in the comment section. I'll check your answer later. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and like. And don't forget to hit the bell icon for notifications of our upcoming videos. Thank you. Bye-bye.